Hey subby buddies, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am filming a brow tutorial video. I have been doing my brows in an entirely different way and I wanted to show you guys how I've been doing it. So I'm going to be taking this spoolie. This is um, an old Colourpop brow pencil, but I'm just going to use the spoolie on the end. And I'm just going to take it and brush my brows in one direction. Now I'm going to take this brow template. It's from Kiss and this Winky Lux brow pencil that I got in my boxy charm. And I'm gonna just take that template and measure it to how my actual brow size is so that I can get a more natural shape. And I am using the full arch side. Now what I'm doing is I am starting from the inner corner and it looks like I'm being pretty harsh and filling it in but I'm actually going very soft. It's just that I have the video sped up so it looks like I'm going ham on my eyebrows but I'm not. It's very soft hand strokes. Now for the arch I do kind of like press it down and shape it out instead of doing a more hair like stroke. Now, as you see, when I take off, well, that's glitter right there, don't mind that, but when I take it off, you can see that it's like a nice, full-looking brow, and with the template, I just switch it over to the opposite side, and I do the exact same thing. This will help ensure that my brows have the same exact length, and they look the same exact side. And for me, I've been doing this for quite some time, and it actually has been a faster routine for me. Now I'm just taking the e.l.f. pomade in light brown and a BH Cosmetics angled brush from the Carnival Brush Celebration set. And I'm just going to go ahead and fill in the brow with that pomade and further shape out the brow that I did while using the template just to make it more cohesive looking and put together and doesn't look like I have product on top of product. Now I'm just gonna brush in the product and distribute it evenly and when you do your brows you always want to have your inner corner of your brow look as much natural as possible almost ombre ish you don't want to put too much product in the front because it's just gonna look like you have used freaking a sharpie marker to do your eyebrows and that's not what we're going for so I'm going to be going in with one more product. This is the LA Colors Brow Kit and I'm going to be using the medium shade which is the closest to my hair color. Um, this is the actual um, kit in medium. And all I'm doing is I like setting my pomade with any type of powder and that's all I'm doing is just doing the same exact thing, filling it in. And I like putting powder mostly in the in the corner of my brows to give it the more natural look. Once again, I'm just gonna take in another brush from the BH Cosmetics set. And I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Con Complete Coverage Concealer in the lightest shade to give my under brow arch a highlighted look. And to clean it up and give it a more sharper look as well. And I'm just going to go ahead and blend it as much as I can with that same brush. And then I'm just taking my finger and blending it out and yeah. 
as you can see what I'm doing is just basically blending it out. And I'm gonna go ahead and do the same exact thing on the other eyebrow. Like you guys, this brush from the Carnival, uh, you see, yeah, I see Dylan in the background. <laughs> the brush from the Carnival Celebration brush set that I'm using to clean up my brows, it's like the bomb. Like, I don't know where it's been my whole entire life. Do not mind that nail that's broken. It literally broke right before filming the video. FML, right? Right before filming the video. Like, how is it going to do me like that? And I'm just cleaning the top of the brow with the closest shade possible to my skin tone. And what I'm doing now is basically taking the same brush that I filled in my brow with, with no additional product on it, and I'm just cleaning up whatever I lost while putting the concealer on. And that is it for the video. That is my look right there that I did with my brows. If you guys want to see me create that look, then just stay tuned to my next video. Bye, guys. Make sure you subscribe to my channel.